It is Giving Tuesday today, a somewhat new holiday that comes after days of material holidays like Cyber Monday. That's right, it's time to give back, and the goal of today is really to inspire generosity during the holiday season. And Meredith Juliet is at an organization right here in central Indiana that's hoping to raise $150,000, and they're on their way to doing that. Meredith, good morning. Hey, good morning, Ben and Karen. I am here at Riley Hospital where they're trying to raise $150,000 for Giving Tuesday. Let's check the board. We are at $8,165 raised, which is awesome because before the commercial break, I had set our goal at getting to 7000 So people are moving quickly, and now we're going to try to set the goal of what? What do you guys think? 9000 by the end of our conversation. So if you'd like to give, it's RileyGivingTuesday.org. And while you guys are getting on your laptops, opening up your smartphones, I'm going to talk to Ben and Beth Edwards. Ben, you are a Riley kid. Tell me about yourself. I am 10, I'm in fourth grade, and I'm a little insane. <laughs> <laughs> he is our kind of our part-time comedian this morning. Beth, tell us a little bit about his Riley story. So when Ben was 18 months old, he had a brain tumor, so he came to Riley to, after our diagnosis, which was a huge shock, yeah, um, sure. he had the brain tumor removed. Um, after his tumor, the shunt, um, his brain fluid didn't uh, learn to reprocess itself. So he had to have a shunt put in, um, went through eight weeks of radiation daily. And then a couple of shunt malfunctions later here, we have a healthy comedian <laughs> that we never know what's going to fly out of his mouth. Sure. Now, Ben, tell me, what does it mean for you to be a Riley kid? I know you get to do a lot of stuff. I heard you had one of these um, kind of fun little posters made up of yourself. What does it mean to be a Riley kid? Well, it means you're constantly walking by the gift shop, which is really hard not to ask to get something. <laughs> yeah, sure. You, <clears throat> there's the game room, yeah. which is up, I think, up there. And then, you kind of know your way around, huh? Halfway, halfway, I think it's a maze. <laughs> now tell me a little bit about the ornament that you were kind of chosen to design. What was that, what's that been all about? Um... I know what it was, but I don't know why I got chose. Maybe because you're awesome, but what did you make? What did you create for everyone? It was a snowman, and then, then in the background I had a Riley wagon with kids in, the, um, in it going down a hill. That's wonderful, and Beth, people can actually buy these ornaments now, correct? Yep, they can. So they're available at Riley Cards, or HolidayCards.org, okay. and then also in the Speedway convenience stores. So you're a Riley family. It's Giving Tuesday, trying to raise $150,000. What would be your push for people to donate today? Well, for us, this giving time of year shows us that Riley gave us our family. Um, we have a whole family. We are a whole unit because of the research, the money that um, Riley gets. Yeah. So for us, giving is the way to keep kids like him healthy and keep families together. Okay, and Ben, what's your kind of sales push for people to give today for Giving Tuesday? We're still... We're still at six, eight thousand one hundred sixty-five. So, just like five seconds ago, we were at eight thousand six one hundred sixty-four. <laughs> so, I think more of a dollar would do a ton. Okay, so that is your push to give. And Ben, I know you've actually interviewed Ben before. We were talking about it, and we were like, "Do you remember when Ben came by the house and interviewed you?" And he goes, "Oh yeah, that's when I had a tiny bed." So that's what he remembers from his. Uh, yeah, he's grown up since then. And I tell you what, Ben's got a future in TV, Meredith. He, he grabbed that microphone right yeah. from you, ready to be a Channel 13 <laughs> Junior reporter.